In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for FeNO3-3. That's iron three nitrate. Iron is a metal, and then we have nitrogen and oxygen. Those are nonmetals. They're bound together in what's called a polyatomic ion. And we have three of these NO3s. Since we have a metal and nonmetals, we have an ionic compound, and the metal will transfer electrons to the nonmetals. So we'll put Fe right here, and then we'll put NO3s around it, three of them. When we look at the name for iron 3 nitrate, the 3 means iron has a plus 3 charge. That means it's lost 3 electrons. So it had 3 valence shell electrons. One went here, that made this negative. Another went here, and then the other one went to this NO3. So that plus 3 tells us iron lost the 3, and it lost them to these nonmetals. Because it lost the 3, and we have this 3 here, we'll put a 3 plus for its charge. Next, let's replace the NO3 minus, the nitrate ion, with a Lewis structure. Then we'll put brackets around each of the nitrate ions. And that makes this the Lewis structure for FeNO3-3, iron 3 nitrate. What we've drawn is one formula unit of a larger crystal. When we have a crystal, it's made up of a bunch of repeating formula units to make that whole crystalline structure. This is Dr. B with the Lewis structure for iron 3 nitrate, and thanks for watching.